Somebody tell, tell you you fired? I don't. Can somebody tell you you fired? Yes or no? Can another man say you're fired? Absolutely. No one can tell me that. And that's priceless to me. But I'm here to What's up, Scorpio? This is 1028 Awakenings, and I'm back again with another motherfucking video. If you guys want a personal reading with me, all of that will be in the description box below this video. Also, do not forget to check out Ty'sWorld.com, which is my daughter's brand, as well as Blending Cultures. What's up, Scorpios? How y'all doing? I hope y'all looking good, smelling good, and motherfucking feeling good. All right, so let's see what's going on. Without further ado, let's see what's good. I do want you guys to know that I go live pretty much every day at 8 a.m., noon, and 4 p.m., okay? At 8 a.m., I do live readings um, for $28.28. There are many reads while on live. And I do do all zodiac sign readings at that time. At 12, I do zodiac sign readings. No, I don't. At 12, I come live and I do a collective reading. And you can also get per personal readings for $28.28. And then at 4, I also come on live again and do a second collective reading. And you can also get personal readings while online for $28.28. Okay. No shocker there why 28 is repeated. That is my day of birth. Okay. So let's get to this reading. Okay. <laughs> All right, Scorpios. And guys, thank you guys so much for the continuous support and love. I really appreciate my Scorpios, man. Y'all really show out for your girl. Okay, so we have um, uh, synchronicity, divine intelligence, and cause and effect, okay? So there's been a really serious... Um, cause and effect okay the web we weave okay so somebody has webbed something a weave here of not following their intuition not paying attention to divine intelligence and because of that that has affected something here they want me to go to the kipper all right so spirit guides and ancestors we come before you now for a clear message what has this affected okay so somebody has blatantly on purpose not followed their intuition not taken the guidance that they've gotten from spirit and because of this it has caused an effect of some sort okay Damn. Okay, spirit guides and ancestors, what's going on? Who what is the effects? Let me ask a question cuz damn, okay? What are the effects of um that are happening to this person? Okay? What what is going on with this? Okay, thank you, spirit. Okay? So, something's going on. Someone didn't follow their intuition, okay? Okay, so this is somebody who basically blocked you. Yeah, they blocked all communication from you. They went a totally different way, Scorpio, or you blocked communicate all communication from somebody and you went another way. You ignored your intuition. You ignored divine intelligence. And because of that, there's some kind of effect that has happened. Okay. All right, let's see what the fuck going on with this shit. Okay. All right, so there's something that's coming in the distant horizon and you can feel it here, okay? So somebody could be losing custody of their kids or they won't be living in the house with their kids anymore here, okay? And it's all because this is some kind of effect. Somebody was ignoring their intuition. They blocked somebody's energy. They went a different way. And in the distant future, they could be like not in a home with their kids, yeah, okay, so, and this is all because they invested in a thief, okay? Um, so somebody's husband is a thief, somebody's wife is a thief, somebody's business partner could be a thief, and there could be somebody's younger brother or sibling that's a thief here, okay? Or a con man or a master manipulator, something like that. It could have something to do with credit card frauds or stealing people's social security number. An uh, entrepreneur has went the wrong way and their business could have to pay. They think about somebody a lot and don't tell anyone that this is happening. Okay, so somebody's in a lot of deep thought about a woman here or a man. Also, somebody's thinking about how they really invested in somebody. With this false person in reverse, 
this false person is actually like doing like black magic wow the cards just flickered off this this black false person is doing black magic on their partner who is an entrepreneur they're basically praying for their business to fail so that if they do leave them which they know that this person is going to leave them they won't have shit this is some fucked up shit. I don't even understand this. This card is not supposed to be here. Okay, this is somebody who lost all love for everything. Music, life, arts, everything. This person could really be sad going through a lot, okay? This person also was dreaming about you, Collective. And this is, all, like, I don't want to say they're having nightmares, but their intuition was telling them to do something and they didn't do it. Look at this shit. The whole board is in reverse. This person invested in a false person. This person didn't send you any messages. They blocked you completely off, went down another journey because they felt like it was the right one for their kids. In the distant future, all of this stuff is basically happening or is happening right now. They went down the wrong path. This false person um, prayed or did like bad spells about like their business failing. And then they found out the only thing that is hurting this person right now is because they found that this person was robbing from them or stealing from them. Okay. It's in the upright. So they do know that whoever they were with either is their brother they're conning from them their wife or they were stealing from someone but or this is you scorpio shit take it as a resonance i don't know all right so somebody here has a luxury car hold on okay so somebody here has a luxury vehicle but it could be getting repossessed but somebody has a very luxury high lifestyle you know they get everything they want you know they have expensive stuff in their life and they pockets look they pockets look full here okay so somebody who was on a high horse could be losing everything. Their pockets could be looking very empty here. Um, their lifestyle could be really messed up and everything could just be going really downhill. Somebody's having a really hard time, Scorpio. I don't know if this is you or them, but somebody's having a really hard time. And all these people that they thought had their back didn't. Okay, yeah. So somebody also realized that whoever that they picked to be a role model for their kids is not a good role model. You know, this person is irresponsible. They cuss in front of the kids. They loud. They up not they just do things that's just not something that any lady should do or any mom should do or any dad should do okay and they just feel like this person is not a good role model for their kids that's this is really sad this is really sad somebody's sad as fuck they crying they don't know what to do and this is all about their 12th house so a lot of karma is being paid back here okay also there's a third party situation okay so there was somebody who had another lover lover or there was like a meddling mom or a meddling dad in this relationship that really destroyed this relationship it could have took a lot of hits okay so a family here a parent is being you know basically very irresponsible with this person they're being very irresponsible with their kids they're not a good dad they're not a good mom they also are cheating and having sex somebody could be wearing timberland boots or something like like this also spirit is telling you like you got a meddling family member that's always just in your business and you just that's just not good you can't have people all up in your business like this it also says meeting your match unable to compete or fight against you because you are just as good as them so there's like a fight in somebody's house where somebody is nasty as fuck and then the other person is matching the nasty fuck energy okay and spirit is just telling you like y'all building up more karma by doing this shit you can't be in no toxic cycle trying to backstab some and one step up up somebody and be like oh i could fuck you over and i could fuck you over better y'all teaching this shit to the kids and let me tell you something too you build up a lot of karma when you have kids and you keep you raise them in toxic ass environments you got to work off their karma too because you're teaching your kid to to be this way to be disruptive and to not follow their intuition and, and also be raised in a very disruptive environment and that's not good that's not good at all okay so somebody is having a lot of issues they burning through a lot of money and they could be in debt with their credit cards they could be throwing through cash and they could be doing really irresponsible shit Whew. that's heavy all right so somebody's going through a lot right now they could even do something that's like impulsive they could spend some money that they know they don't have when they shouldn't really be doing that okay and it's all really to get back at somebody somebody stole somebody money too and they together yep okay so somebody had a private relationship with someone and that has been exposed and this is why all of this is happening so somebody had a private relationship which could have been a secret and now it's been revealed that somebody was meeting up and doing that somebody could have backstabbed somebody how did this secret come out how did this private relationship secret come out how does this private relationship secret come out 
How did this private relationship secret come out? <laughs> Sudden wealth in reverse. Okay, so. Wow. Okay, so this private relationship was the catapult to somebody's whole life going upside down. Okay, somebody could be saying that. Basically, oh, you cheated on your wife or you cheated on something. And this is why your relationship is messed up. This is why you're losing your business. This is why you don't have anything because you've been cheating. Okay, but what is important here, it says diet is health and prayer works. So and that's not true. To be honest with you, this relationship ended. Um, really because this person is supposed to move out of this relationship and somebody been praying for something to change. You know, they also been praying for somebody who cooks and cleans and has balanced, um, lifestyle and contributed traits and will improve their health and even probably even improve their kids health. But whoever they was with didn't do that. They were praying for this person to be better and change, but you can't pray for somebody to change. Like they got to want to change. I don't know who was doing this dumb shit, but you can't pray for your spouse to change. Somebody could be stalking somebody on social media okay and they wanted sudden wealth with this person they wanted sudden wealth with who was they with but this person was false as hell this person was only using you for your car or only using you to get materialistic things and now you see the effects of investing in people who really don't give a fuck about you this could be a hard truth for somebody also somebody wants to come in they want to fix it they want to communicate with you scorpio okay they also want you to have they want to have a public relationship with you and this is somebody who is a childhood love affair okay so this is somebody that you knew since childhood. They really, really love you. They want to come in. They want to fix things with you. And they want to have a relationship with you in public. They don't want to have uh, to hide to see you, okay? Maybe y'all was hiding in the past here. This person is secretly watching you on social media. It came up again. Okay, so Scorpio, you got somebody from the past that you knew ever since you was a kid. They want to fix things with you. And they also want you to be their girl or they do. And they don't want to hide it. They want the world to know. The best thing about life is that everything that I have ever lost has been replaced with something 10 times better. Like I never lack, I just transition.